And we are back. This is Legacy Season 2, Episode 15, our new penultimate episode of the season. Yes, it's official. Instead of 20 episodes of the season, we're only having 16, just like Season 1. It's... it's disappointing, because that means we're not going to be able to finish the season, but... Understandable. Health, cast, and crew come first, so... Understandable. And I think Julie confirmed Episode 16 is still supposed to have some sort of cliffhanger, so it'll feel almost finale-like. Um, and then the remaining four episodes we were supposed to get are likely going to be the first four of Season 3. So the stuff with the Necromancer is going to be not resolved next season. Dark Josie, I think, is supposed to end next episode, the, fin the new finale. So as long as it's a satisfying cliffhanger that sets up Season 3 and feels like a good cliffhanger, then I'm good. So, but yeah, last week's episode was really good. Tonight, it looks like we're going to be dealing with more Dark Josie. I'm excited because I like Dark Josie. So, I feel like someone might die either this week or next week. I don't know who. I mean, I could be wrong. I mean, I don't know. But either way, things are gonna start getting more intense more than they already have. Nightmare. Yeah, he did something to him. I swear, if the theory is right that Necromancer killed him, and he's gonna die again permanently, I'm gonna be very upset. We just have to find her. Now she found you. I'm right here, though. Can we keep the book though? It's so good. Oh, hello. Don't look so shocked. Did you really think that I would miss my birthday? Me. Oh, I'm sorry. Same as Kate? Um, I just don't see it that way. We know. Can I just sit this one out? Oh, they're putting him in the game. Okay. What was the plan? <laughs> Time out for a lark. <laughs> And now I have to ruin the surprise. Emerge. Yep. She wants to kill Lizzie and take her power. Emerging isn't even possible. We're not 22. Yeah, see, it turns out that's just a guideline. Kind of like driving a car, smoking cigarettes. But it can happen wants before you to that. do it before you're old enough. But you can. So, I'll see you both tonight. Finger foods at around 7.30ish. And then emerge at 8. Oh. And don't be late, Lizzie, or else I'd like to do something drastic. This isn't drastic enough. Happy birthday, girls. I am my biggest fan, and even I know that Lord Josie Mort is gonna squash me Lord in a Josie Mort. That's why I'm here. To clean up my bug guts? No, to train you. <laughs> I love this, but it's all gonna go horribly wrong. <laughs> I am the master of the unknown. Oh, I thought I was going to say a different answer. Reaper of souls, the almighty necromancer. Dramatic. I thought you'd be taller. Wait, so Alyssa's just gone like that? Just like that? Okay. So if you're running, I'm running too. Aww. Can I just get together already? Oh my god. Oh, he brought Alyssa back. I swear, he did the same thing to rap. He's controlling him. My selfish sister didn't show up! Who am I gonna kill? Should it be... The Necromancer. Maybe... Witches? No, kill the Necromancer. How about 
some werewolves. Yes, queen. Oh my god. Oh, yes, queen. Try all three. <laughs> yep. What is this? Someone did die by that tree, man. It was me. Necromancer killed him. Brought him back and he was controlling him. Some Harry Potter shit. But just if we're gonna do Harry Potter shit, Hope should be the one using Expelliarmus type magic. Everybody shut up! Hope. Josie? Joe, you? Oh, she's fighting. Our Josie's fighting. Do you really think that you'd be the one that would bring out my good side? I don't even think she likes you. Ah, oh, fuck. No, no, no. So, any last words for your tombstone? I know you're in there, Josie. Someone do something. Where's Lizzie? Lizzie gonna come home with the save. Lizzie? Lizzie? I should have mentioned this earlier. Yes! But black really isn't your color. Nah. You're late to your own funeral. No. I am right on time to kick your ass. Yes! Oh my god. Just to be clear, that was for you. And not me. Just in case I lose. Alright, sister Satan. This episode is serving. That's I fought. <laughs> and I ran. Oh, Chad, I believed in you. <laughs> Me, and he's controlling him now. So I need you to take care of him. No, don't make Landon do it. No. <laughs> take care of him. He wants Landon to kill him. No. Kill you. Absolutely not. Fuck this. You're my brother. And I don't have free will, Landon. And you do. Don't let me be a puppet, man. Stop with the sad music, you're gonna make me cry. Sad music is banned. You have free will. Use it. No. No. I vote yeah. no. Don't cry, Dad. She won. One last mouth to feed. Oh, they would not kill Lizzie off. Nah. So wait, what did they do exactly? Oh, see, I knew she wasn't gone. So Landon was planning. Yeah. What, what exactly happened? Hell of a plan. Well, you guys. Okay. So what the hell? It's quite Your life, sweetheart. And that's all that matters right now. That means that I won. Well, that, that I. Joe won. Fine. She thinks she won. But, uh. Hope had a plan B. The potion she made wasn't just to keep your mind separate from Joe's. It linked your life to Landon's, to Landon's temporarily. So when you died, you died too. But since he's immortal, you came back. Clever. He did. So, hopes in Josie's mind? Yeah, that explains the still from the next episode. That. Of Hope dressed as Red Riding Hood and Josie as Belle? Or Snow White, whatever? 
busy. Do I have a choice? None. All in. So we're not gonna kill Raph? Always. Okay, great, we're not gonna kill Raph. Good. I don't know, we still two minutes left, and I think it happened. Raph. Nah, I think we're good. No choice. Fuck. Oh! No, no, the golden arrow, no, the golden arrow! No, 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 Oh, come on. Fuck off. Um, excuse me, what the fuck was that? Okay, they had me in the first half. They had me thinking Raph was gonna die, but no, he stopped landing with the golden arrow. So wait, okay, is this real? Is he like, is he dead dead now? Cause I'll be very pissed if he's dead dead now. Bird boy, you better wake the fuck up. But didn't the Sphinx dude say that with the hero could die by the golden arrow and he just fell by the golden arrow so isn't that like a permanent death? He can't come back even though he's a phoenix? I'll be very pissed because now that means Hope is going to lose another person she loves. Hell, we may not even see Hope's reaction next week. Next week it's going to be all about getting Josie back. We may not even see her reaction because it's the last fucking episode. <sighs> Oh, God. Part of me is kind of in denial, because... I don't know. Is it permanent? It felt like it, but I don't know. Would they really just kill Landon like that? Well, it's confirmed the Necromancer killed Rav and is controlling him that... Pretty much everyone knew that. But they had me in the first half. They had me thinking Raph was going to die. And I was almost pissed because they... In season one and all of season two, they haven't really done anything with Raph. They really haven't. He is what I would call wasted potential. He has so much potential and they don't do anything with him. So if they killed him off, I would have been really pissed. But now I'm even more pissed because they just... I think killed Landon permanently. I hope not. I don't know. But other than that, this episode was really good. It served. They killed Alyssa, but now she's back, sort of, with the Necromancer controlling her. Does that mean when they stop the Necromancer, everyone that he killed and is controlling will die permanently? Alyssa, Wrath. So if I'm right, that means Wrath is going to die anyway. Waste potential. <sighs> um, Dark Josie is amazing. Literally... Probably Legacy's the best villain. Malivore is poop, literally. He's a poop monster. Clark, I'm gonna be the minority, but I actually really like Clark. I think the main reason why I liked Clark so much because of Nick Fink. I love Nick Fink. I want Clark to come back. Like I know Necromancer decapitated him, but he threw his head in the Malivore pit, Malivore portal. So could he potentially come back? I hope so, cause I liked Clark. Um. But yeah, and the Necromancer, he's not the worst villain, he's just the whole over-the-top dramatic sense he has gets kind of meh after a while. It's like, been there, done that, Did we, like, can we move on? Like, he can be cool at times, but Dark Josie, she takes the cake. Um... But yeah, this episode was just serving Lizzie and MG kiss. I I do ship it. I really do. So I want them. To, I hope. I really hope they explore that more. Um, but yeah, next week is our new finale. I'm not 100% sure if Julie confirmed that we're supposed to get some sort of cliffhanger. 
we're definitely gonna get old Josie back next episode, I think, definitely. Dark so the dark Josie stuff ends next week. I don't know the I don't know about the Necromancer. I think the Necromancer is staying till well, he was staying till the end of the season, but now the Necromancer storyline is probably gonna be resolved because the last four episodes of the season are likely gonna be the first four episodes of season three. So the stuff with the Necromancer is likely gonna be resolved by episode four of season three. And then after the Necromancer stuff is done, they're probably gonna start a whole new storyline with a whole new villain. But anyway, that was Legacy Season 2, Episode 15, overall fucking amazing episode, but the ending. Oh god, I know I'm probably in the minority here, because I, I know a lot of people hate Landon, I don't know why. I mean, I know a lot of people don't ship Handon, which I can understand, Handon's not for everyone. Because I know a lot of people ship Hosey, trust me, I do too. I'm a multi-shipper on this show. I ship Handon, I ship Hosey, I ship Posey. I sort of ship Hizzy. I don't see Hizzy happening romantically, but I do love their dynamics, so in a way I guess I do ship them. Hizzy, Hosey, Posey, Handon, uh, Lizzie G. I did ship Sizzy at first, Lizzie and Sebastian, but not anymore. Lizzie G, like I already said. Um, yeah, I'm a multi-shipper. So while I do love Handon, I do love Hosey, and I would love for Hosey to happen romantically, because I want it. <sighs> I don't know, it just felt kind of a, almost abrupt the way they killed Landon. I don't know. I want to say it's permanent because it's the golden arrow, but I don't, I don't know. I feel like there's a catch. But hey, I have no fucking idea, so we're likely not going to find out about that next week. Next week is going to be getting Josie back and then some sort of cliffhanger. And then we wait until October for season three. Well, hey, maybe there's a chance that if if they get to filming the last four episodes, they could release them in the summer sometime as like a special. They could release the last four episodes as like a two-hour special. Wait, well, no, they can't do two hours. That'd be like four hours. They could do like. I like could release them in the summer or something. That would be get a proper season two ending. I don't know, but the most likely option is next week is our finale. The final four episodes are going to be the first four of season three. So, hey, as long as the cliffhanger next week is good and satisfying, I'm good. But anyway, that is it for now. Be sure to let me know what you thought of this episode and what your theories are on for what will happen next week. And I will see you guys next time.